17 Crazy Dinosaur Discoveries The dinosaur craze started when people began finding their bones in the ground and realized what they belonged to in the early 1800s. People haven't stopped being fascinated with the extinct creatures in the years since, and who can blame them when those bones belong to animals bigger than mammoths that roamed both land and sea in a time long ago? Here's some crazy dinosaur discoveries that have fascinated humans for the last two centuries. Number 17, the fighting dinosaurs. One of the most stunning dinosaur fossils ever found. The finding dinosaurs were discovered embedded in the white sandstone cliffs of the barren Gobi Desert in 1971. The two dinosaur remains are clearly engaged in a struggle. The velociraptor has its foot claw stuck into the neck of the protoceratops, while the protoceratops appears to have broken the right arm of his foe with a bite. Judging from their poses, the pair must have been buried quickly. The likely culprits were a prehistoric collapsing dune or a sandstorm. Number 16, the feathered giant. This odd creature of the early Cretaceous period was around 30 feet tall, weighed over 3,000 pounds, and was covered in feathers, making it the largest known dinosaur specimen that contained direct evidence of feathers. Experts acquired three nearly complete specimens in China from a fossil dealer who said that they had all been found in a single quarry. Number 15. Gualico. Comparable to the infamous T-Rex, the 20-foot-tall Gualico possessed reduced arms and little two-fingered hands. We didn't know about the existence of this dinosaur until 2007. It lived during the Upper Cretaceous period around 93 million years ago in what is now northern Patagonia, but what was then a South American island. Number 14. Deinonychus. When remains of this dinosaur were discovered and the animal was described by Yale paleontologist John Ostrom in the 1960s, it changed the way people thought about dinosaurs. The Deinonychus was found to have a large claw on each foot, long arms with grasping hands, and a stiffened tail that helped the creature keep its balance while it ran after prey. It could grow to be up to 11 feet long. Finding the Deinonychus made people realize that dinosaurs on the whole were much more active than had previously been surmised. The animal lived around 110 million years ago and fossils have been recovered in Montana, Utah, Wyoming, Oklahoma, and Maryland in the years since its initial discovery. Number 13. Diplodocus Samuel Wendell Williston, this cool looking hombre, found the first fossil of the Diplodocus at Cannon City, Colorado in 1877. The Diplodocus lived 154 million years ago and was absolutely massive. As you can see they dwarfed a standard human being, growing as long as 110 feet, which for years ranked as the longest known dinosaur. Estimates have their weight as high as 113 tons which is hard to even fathom. Number 12. Dracoraptor. Paleontologists searching for the remains of giant prehistoric fish stumbled upon the remains of the Dracoraptor in March 2014. They lived around 200 million years ago, making them the oldest known Jurassic dinosaurs and were bipedal. Estimates state that adults likely grew to a length of up to 10 feet. Number 11. Archaeopteryx. These creatures served as a bridge between feathered dinosaurs and modern birds. Most experts agree that while they're considered dinosaurs, they're also the oldest known birds. They were less than two feet in length and roamed the earth some 150 million years ago during the late Jurassic period. As you can see in this restoration, it looked kind of like a raven. The first complete specimen was discovered in 1861, and 10 more fossils have been unearthed in the years since. Number 10. Titanosaur. While the Diplodocus is a huge animal, the Titanosaur is the biggest dinosaur ever discovered. Scientists estimate that the creature weighed as much as 70 tons with a length of 122 feet. A rancher in southern Argentina found fossils of the Titanosaur along with bones belonging to five other dinosaurs in 2012. The specimen was the best preserved ever discovered and allowed experts to create an accurate replica that took up residence in New York's American Museum of Natural History in early 2016. This skeleton was created based off of 84 original fossils. Number 9. Myasaura. Myasaura were first discovered in 1978 in Montana. They were unique as being the first dinosaurs found to feed its young while they were in the nest. Hundreds of bones and skeletons have been found that sit in museums around the world. Myasaura were herbivores that lived in the Upper Cretaceous period around 76.7 million years ago. Number 8. Cynosauropteryx. People were stunned when the first specimen of the Cynosauropteryx was uncovered in 1996. It was found in China's Liaoning province, the first ever discovered in the area. It would also turn out to be the first dinosaur found with evidence of feathers. The creatures weren't very big. They only grew to around three and a half feet in length and weighed just over a pound. They had a pretty neat color scheme, as you can see in this recreation of what they looked like. Number seven, Leonardo. Paleontologists were overjoyed when in 2002, they found the remarkably well-preserved fossilized skeleton of a 77 million year old duck-billed dinosaur. Dubbed Leonardo, the creature was 22 feet long and weighed nearly two tons. He was very young when he died, only three to four years old. The skeleton was covered in skin, scales, muscles, and foot pads. It even still had the creature's last meal in its stomach. Experts considered it a mummy because of its preserved soft tissue. 
At the time, this made it only the fourth dinosaur fossil mummy ever. Number 6. The Montana Dueling Dinosaurs A Montana rancher, now known as the Dinosaur Cowboy, discovered this incredibly rare fossil in the state's Hell Creek Formation. Like the aforementioned fighting dinosaurs, this fossil is made of the bones of two specimens that appeared to have died fighting each other. The remains belong to a pony-sized carnivore, called a Tyrannosaurid, and a slightly larger herbivore called a Ceratopsian. The remarkable find is now preserved in plaster and sitting in a vault. Number 5. Notosaur Though it hasn't been alive for 110 million years, this notosaur looks like it may suddenly start moving around at any moment, millions of years after it died, and was likely carried out to sea before being buried, intact, in sediment. It was unearthed in Alberta's tar sands in 2011. Most agree that the 18-foot-long specimen is the best-preserved armored dinosaur in the world. A Canadian museum unveiled this amazing sight in May, so that any dinosaur lover out there could go see the lifelike notosaur for themselves. Number 4. Amazing Amber Tail Paleontologists were thrilled when the tail of a small, feathered dinosaur was found perfectly preserved in amber in northeastern Myanmar last year. Examiners were amazed at the details they could discern, like the bones, flesh, skin, and feathers of the appendage just by looking through the amber. The discovery was made in a fairly unlikely place, an amber market. The seller had polished the 99 million year old amber for jewelry, thinking the tail was nothing more than plant material. Number 3. Hadrosaurus A man was digging a pit off the Cooper River in New Jersey in 1838 when he unexpectedly stumbled upon the first skeleton of a hadrosaurus ever found. As it turns out, that would be the only fossil of the dinosaur ever recorded. The dinosaur's remains were nearly complete. A team assembled the skeleton in 1868 and put it on display at the Philadelphia Academy of Natural Sciences. People were in awe of the Hadrosaurus, as they were seeing what was the first mounted dinosaur skeleton in the world. Number 2. Iguanodon the year after the Megalosaurus was officially recognized as the first formerly named dinosaur, the Iguanodon became the second. Gideon Mantell, this guy, discovered some of the animal's teeth sometime in the early 1820s. A nearly complete skeleton was found in 1834 that sits in the Natural History Museum in London to this day. Their most unique and crazy characteristic is their large thumb spikes, which were likely used for defense against predators. The most substantiated species lived in Europe approximately 125 million years ago. Iguanodon were giant plant eaters that measured around 3 tons on average and stretched out as long as 43 feet. Before we go to our last and craziest dinosaur discovery, we'd like to thank all of our loyal subscribers for their continued support. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Click that button. Now, number one, Megalosaurus. Though a lower part of its femur was discovered in the 17th century, and it would become the first non-avian dinosaur to be validly named in 1824, there's still a lot about the Megalosaurus that's unknown. People didn't know what that femur was for years. At first, experts theorized that it was the thigh bone of a Roman war elephant. Pieces have been found, but never a complete skeleton, making much about its build unclear. It was about 23 feet long and weighed a little over a ton. They lived during the Jurassic period around 166 million years ago. They were bipedal with short, stocky forelimbs and a rather large head.